Yo, what's up? This is Scott Talinsky with Level Up Tuts, and today we're going to be leveling up your function skills in SAS. What we're going to be doing today is building our own function. Now this is very powerful because it can pretty much do uh, whatever you need it to do, whatever you can come up with. Um, if, let's say there's not a built-in function already in SAS, as we went over in the last lesson, um, you, can, you can create your own and have the same functionality. So for the, this first example, what we're going to do is we're going to take a look at a background color. Let's say the background color of this div right here. And then we're going to make the text a lighter shade of this background color so that um, it doesn't get, you know, right now it's way too dark for this background. So to build our own function, it's actually pretty easy. Um, the first thing you need to do is do an at function and then your function's name. So we're just going to call this text contrast. And inside the parentheses, you're going to put your arguments for the function. So the arguments we want to take are the background color. Um, so we'll just call this, yeah, background. And we're also going to take a value. And this is going to tell us how much to lighten it, um, you know, based on whatever we want. So um, let's just say val. And then we're going to do brackets and hit enter. So when you're making a function, your goal is to have it output something, right? So to output something, uh, you do the at return. And so this is going to be whatever your function's going to output. Um, so what we want it to do is we want it to take back, oh, typing background, and we want it to add value to it. And then here, we're going to put a semicolon, go back to our terminal. As you can see, nothing wrong. So we're all good there. So now that this function's created, um, you know, refresh your document, it doesn't do anything because we're not calling this function anywhere. So to call this function, it's the exact same as when we called the nth function or when we called round or percentage. Um, so what we're going to do, let's say we want to edit uh, number three here. We're going to do our class three. Inside of three, we're going to say the color of our text is going to be uh, text contrast. And then inside parentheses, we're going to pass it the, uh, the background color, which is black plus 40. And then the value that we want to increase it by, let's say 100. We're going to save this out, check our SAS. Um, there's no no problems there. Refresh, and as you can see, the color is now 100 lighter than the background. This isn't bad for building our first function. However, there's lots more you can do with functions. In the next tutorial, we're going to um, automate this process a little bit more. So it's taking in the function from this list, and it's going to determine uh, if the background color is light enough or dark enough and then do something different based on the value of the background color. Um, once again, this is Scott Talinsky with Level Up Tuts. If you have any questions, feel free to ask, uh, send us a message, or hit us up on Twitter at uh, Level Up Tuts. Uh, all right, see you in the next one. Bye.